All right, so we want to find and prove that these are the inverses of each other and then state their domain. All right, so we do f of g of x. So this is going to be 2 times 1 half x minus 3 plus 6. And this, if this whole thing equals x, that's we're off to a good start. All right, so this ends up being, if we distribute the 2, it's x minus 6 plus 6. These cancel out. We get x. Now, if g of f of x um, equals uh, x, then these are the inverses of each other. All right, so we get um, 1 half, 2x plus 6 minus 3. So we end up with x plus 3 minus 3, and we end up with x. So that's good. That means that f of x and g of x are inverses of each other. Uh, are there any restrictions on the domain? The answer is no. And the reason why is because x isn't in any denominators. If it were, it could be possible to have a divide by 0, and that would uh, create an asymptote. So domain, all reals, and f of g of x equals g um, of f of x equals x. Um, f of x, however you want to say this, and g of x are inverses of each other. Okay, that's it.